adding family members from the main member screen I'm just gonna go ahead and select the member and this is a female so I'm gonna add a husband to this member so down to the bottom you see it gives you the ability to add a husband add a wife add a father mother etc so I'm gonna hit add husband so it's asking me for the first name of the husband it automatically assumes that the last name is the same it filled out the gender for us I'm gonna hit next so the information assumes that they live together I'm gonna select him as a visitor now we have to select a married date because it's husband and wife so we're just gonna do now the importance of the marriage date is that whenever you select married in the system for members the system would automatically on that wedding date shoot an email to the husband and the wife just to remind them a month before their anniversary that their anniversary is coming up and on the day of their anniversary it will send them an email again wishing them happy anniversary and hit not sure here and I'm not gonna select a picture for this individual are you sure you want to save this information yes so now if we go to the family tree we'll see Sally and Darren Moss because it picked up that Sally is married to Darren now from here we're gonna add let's add a child to Sally and Darren and yeah Darren So what the system did is it automatically looked at the last name and picked up everyone in your database that had the same last name, which is Moss. So it's just a confirmation that you know you selected a age, 18 years or younger, just say yes. The phone number, I'm gonna just put something in for right now and like I said remember the email address if you fill it in then your just member software will email this particular individual on their birthday I'm gonna pick that he's a visitor also uh, saying this is a kid I'm gonna leave him as being single not sure for baptism and work I'm gonna select that he's a student so now if I go back to the family tree it shows Sally and Darren Moss and Bob Moss is their child so it works the same way for adding a husband a wife a father a mother a child uh, it'll just show up differently on their family tree now let's just say for instance um, I've added the husband and this uh, child in error and they were actually not the family members of Sally Jane Moss what I would have to do is just hit detach from family and this would go ahead and remove uh, that family setup that we just did